Hey guys, it's Julie. Uh, we've been spending the past two weeks really focusing on our reflections and our gratitude for all that was our business success in 2020. And we are so grateful for that. And on the heels of that, as we sit among a world with this obviously showing us some very new stories uh, daily, we wonder what is the projection for the real estate market in 2021. And so as much as I always advise you, don't focus too much on news reports because oftentimes one, that's a, a reflection of national news and not embodying our our local market but two it's a matter of is that relevant for what your pocket of real estate is for your type of property so the take-home is always to consult a professional and we're happy to give you an analysis but in terms of the projections for 2021 we are riding out momentum of a very positive 2020 and looking forward to a 2021 which which is slated to show continued low interest rates uh, an increase of five to ten percent depending on its new construction or resale homes our demand is still high, our inventory is still low. We should see more new construction, uh, prime opportunities for builders if they can create lots uh, to be developed or uh, flip opportunities just to create the inventory. We're seeing an increase in multi-generational living and of course an increase in people moving from the city into the suburban areas. Uh, all of this again is our local forecast. Please don't get too bogged down with what the national forecast is. The Boston proper area tends to do better than the national averages of real estate. So again, we caution you, don't focus too much on the national headlines. Our local market, the stats are strong on the momentum of 2020. We look at where the two months behind right so our market is two months behind what it typically is or two months ahead however you look at it which means our pendings going into January are much higher our spring market is slated to start much younger much sooner excuse me and it is a prime time to evaluate is it time for you to make a move is it time for you to get that bigger house is it time for you to set up that full work from home that you anticipate will be the new normal regardless if it's COVID election year uh, we are very grateful for 2020 and looking at the facts not the news reports, but the facts of 2021. And if you are interested in getting an analysis, an evaluation of your situation, or just get some real estate questions answered, don't hesitate to reach out and we wish you a hopeful and prosperous year ahead.